integration with other back office systems. So if you look at the turnover and profit, uh, which is very, uh, it shows that we are very small even today, but uh, uh, you will find that there has been a dip. We have just taken the last three years and it's not a projection, the real figures for the last three years. So like, you know, it's, there has been a dip between 2014 and 15, owing to obvious reasons related to, uh, you know, changes in business direction and also some of our customers not doing so well and of course the uh, contractual promises made were not fulfilled 100%. So there has been a dip in 2000, but we have made it up and uh, like if you look at the 2016 figure, it looks quite promising and it's kind of doubled up from what it was the previous years. And that's because our sales of the product has also started, uh, you know, uh, growing. And um, uh, we intend to see ourselves as a pure play product company within three years. Right now the revenue is still a mix of service and product. But even though when you say product, it's going to be software as service. So in that sense, we will still remain a service company. <coughs> the employee strength is uh, like, you know, we on an average used to have more than 25 employees. And there has been some changes in the last year and after which we again uh, have made fresh recruitments and the strength is, stands at around 30. Talking about the process and quality standards, like earlier, you know, software companies uh, believed in getting certification, the CMMI level five or CMMI, and uh, I'm not saying that is changing, but I think the approach is changing today because people are slowly moving towards a process called uh, Agile, and Agile is not really that new. It's also almost a decade old. But the right areas of applying Agile, people have started discovering only recently and made the right kind of implementations and started getting the benefits. So we have a, a, a you know, delivery process, like which is uh, in collaboration with customers when it comes to our services and uh, our own processes when it comes to our product. But in either case, we follow uh, the Scrum model where you know we promote a lot of autonomy because here we cannot really afford to have a very hierarchical organization. Neither can we make the uh, process over specified. So we have to keep it lean.